Mike is one of those individuals that can form a relationship with anyone. He comes across very quiet, he keeps to himself, but his ability to be able to read a student or even one of his peers and figure out how to connect with them uh, is one of the things that I think is one of his best qualities. His impact is seen uh, almost, almost daily. Uh, every time I come into the classroom, he's working with somebody else in a capacity that I that I just think, yeah, that's that's going above and beyond. I can only imagine Mike's Spanish is limited at best, and and the reality is his ability to break through to students who don't even have the ability to speak English as a first language uh, is an impact that you can see right off the bat. Over the years, with my prior position, um, I had a lot of students that were at-risk students, and maybe the Career Center on paper didn't look like it was the best option for them. Uh, and Mike, each and every time, would always be willing to take on that student and work with them. And that's what I remember about Mike, is that we would see where students would start, and we would see where students would end with Mike. And many of these kids would be going out during their senior year for paid internships, because Mike had mentored them and helped them connect with him and with this field. Mike is a, a lead by example guy. He is, and when I say lead by example, he consistently sets the example of how uh, you should do things. Um, not only in his way he would uh, always respectfully talk to students, but his respect level for everybody, uh, no matter what your role in life is, he is going to treat you like you, like everybody should be treated, honestly. And uh, so I think people would think of Mike as the quiet leader. This year he got uh, Teacher of the Year uh, here at the Career Center. It was hard for me to believe that, that this year was the only year he was Teacher of the Year. The reality is that guy could be in the running every year. Um, his ability not only to teach kids, you know, I, I aspire to be what Mike Maloney is. And, and even talking with a fellow, uh, a fellow teacher who's retiring this year, he said, I, all, I came in with Mike Maloney, but I'll tell you what, I always tried to be Mike Maloney because that's how important Mike was and Mike is to what we're doing. Mike, I, I think on behalf of myself and hopefully everybody here at the Career Center, I, I say we, we will miss you. Um, I imagine you're going to be a guy that tries to stay away. Uh, please don't completely stay away from us. Uh, trust me, everybody will want to see you. Uh, everybody will be glad to see you. So hopefully don't make yourself too much of a uh, stranger. We look forward to seeing you in the future and uh, your first concert that you have after this, I would like to be invited to, so. Mike, you're gonna be dearly missed. Um, you and Bob Bailey uh, did a great job with our collision repair and refinishing program. Um, students came out a lot better uh, when they left your program uh, and it's gonna be a difficult replace. Um, I hope you don't disappear. I hope we have the opportunity to see you around. The door will always be open and your peers will always be looking forward to seeing you. Uh, take care, continue playing guitar, riding motorcycles, and uh, get out and see some folks. Take care.